Hey there, Crafty Jennabug here. Yet another wooden shape from the Dollar Tree. I can't help myself. Sheep craft supplies, just do it for me. Again, this one, I'm gonna do another paint pour on. Surprise, surprise. Y'all know how I love my paint pours. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do another paint pour. And this one, before we do the paint pour, of course, we gotta prime it. Gonna use my handy dandy Apple Barrel white acrylic paint. And we will get started. And there it is, all primed. Gonna let it do its thing and dry. And then it will be time to paint pour. <laughs> Stay tuned. What we're gonna do is another Dutch pour, cause why not? And I've got metallic gold, champagne, and metallic pearl white. And those are the colors I'm gonna use on here, I'm gonna go ahead and mix up my colors. All right, got my workspace situated. I'm going to mix up my colors. Alright, just like last time, I am going to pour it like this and then prop it up so that it can drip. I have some pre-mixed white paint mixed with, it's mixed with Floetrol and water, just white acrylic paint. And I'm going to do a base in that. just to give the uh, other paint something to move on. Okay, so I'm going to spread this paint. I think that's where I'm gonna leave it and let it dry and see how it looks when it's done. As always, we'll be back to for the reveal. 
when it's all dry. Let's zoom out. Here's the finished star. I really like how it turned out. It's uh, it's very cool, very marbly, and I, I dig that a lot. Um, this was really fun to do. I uh, I really enjoy these uh, the Dutch pour. Hi, Kitty. You investigating? What do you think? Is it good? You like it? Oh, moving on. All right, she's not impressed. Um. I really like the Dutch pour method. It it's a lot of fun, and it always well the two times I've done it, it seems to make some really cool marbling effects um, that I just can't get enough of. So I'm going to affix a ribbon to this one like I did the other two and hang it on my wall. As always, I appreciate you watching my videos, and uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Have a great day.